subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon, to never miss a video from us. Hi everyone, welcome to Test Prep Training. In this video you will learn about some commonly asked questions in IBM Maximo Asset Management V7.6 Functional Analyst. So let's get started. Question number 1. A dispatcher needs to know the available staff for any given day. Laborers must track vacation time for the dispatcher to use. Where can this be done? Your options are A. Define person availability in the people application B. Modify person availability in the people application C. Define person availability in the calendar's application D. Modify person availability in the calendar's application The correct answer is, option B. Question number 2, a company has a requirement to report on actual labor hours, materials, services and tools used as work progresses on a work order. What is the earliest point in the basic life cycle a user can start reporting? Your options are A. APPR B. COMP C. WMATL D. WAPPR the correct answer is, option A. Question number 3, a vendor requires a payment of 20% of the purchase price when the purchase order is sent, and the company wants to withhold of the payment until 90 days, after receiving the item before final payment is made. How would this be accomplished? Your options are A. A purchase requisition would be created and three invoices would be generated via the invoicing application. One invoice for 20%. One for 60% and one for 20%. B. A price contract would be created with a payment schedule with an invoice of 20% at the time the PO is approved, an invoice of 60% at the time the item is received and her invoice for 20% 90 days after receipt. C. A blanket contract would be created with a payment schedule with an invoice of 20% at the time the PO is approved, an invoice of 60% at the time the item is received and another invoice for 20% 90 days after receipt. D. A purchase contract would be created with a pay payment schedule, with an invoice of 20% at the time the PO is approved, an invoice of 60% at the time the item is received and another invoice for 20% 90 days after receipt. The correct answer is, option D. Question number 4. A company wishes to group its location records into a hierarchy to assist users in searching for assets. How can this be accomplished? Your options are A. Location groups can be created and live locations added. B. Locations can be linked by using the related records tab in the locations application. C. Location records will need to be added to a network, and can only include locations with an active status. D. Location records need to be added a system, and can only include locations with an operating type. The correct answer is, option D. Question number 5. A company has assets at multiple locations that require maintenance. There is a requirement to have a single work order with charges rolled up to a single GL account. How can that be achieved? Your options are A. Create a task work order for each asset. B. Create a child work order for each asset. C. Add a job plan that has the assets associated. D. Add the assets in multiple assets, locations, and CLS. The correct answer is, option B. Question number 6, an administrator has a requirement to create 44 new assets that each share a common configuration. Which application can do this with a single action? Your options are, A. Assets. B. Item Master. C. Classifications. D. Asset Templates. The correct answer is, option D. Question number 7. A user belongs to two non-independent security groups, Group A and Group B. Group A has a purchasing limit of $7,000 and Group B has a purchasing limit of $8,000. What is the purchasing limit of a user who belongs to both security groups? Your options are A. $7,000 B. $8,000 C. $15,000 D. $56,000 The correct answer is, option B. Question number 8, 
what costing method should be used if the receipt cost of items that are the newest in stock is required. Your options are A. LIFO B. FIFO C. Average D. Standard The correct answer is, option A. Question number 9, which report option provides multiple access points for an end user to run reports including the toolbar shortcuts of browser view, direct print, direct print with attachments, and direct access from application dialogues including work order status change and inventory reorder. Your options are A. ERI B. BIRT C. Cognos D. SQL Server The correct answer is, option B. Question number 10. An approved work order has been assigned an incorrect job plan. How do you correct this? Your options are A. Change the job plan revision to the correct revision. B. Clear the job plan field and enter the correct job plan. C. Create a follow-up work order with the correct job plan. D. Select Remove Work Plan from the More Actions menu, and enter the correct job plan. The correct answer is, option D. For more such videos, subscribe to our channel.